for the uh, kind invitation of the Albanian authorities for us to meet this year in this very historical city of Tirana, and uh, which I believe is a very promising. Honorable Chairman, Mr. Ludwig, Honorable Representatives, ladies and gentlemen. It is a great pleasure for me, in the position of the Albanian Shot, to be here today and to have the possibility to say something in the opening ceremony of your important meeting. On this occasion, I would like to welcome all of you and thank you for being here. More than 20 years ago, the division walls of the border were raised up to the size dividing the airspace in some countries almost prohibited being overflight by the civil flight. This was the time of divisions, time when military and civilians were seated in different tables speaking different languages. The foundation of NATA, National Air Traffic Agency, in the early 19s was an important step forward, introducing one of the most significant factors in Albanian space management philosophy. Albania Air Force. As the biggest user and service provider since that moment, supported by our partners and NATO, initiated different modernization programs, personal training and new policy collaboration to implement NATO and ICAO standards. New development in European and NATO environment regarding the airspace management show clearly that Albania Air Force and NATO must have the same language. Albanian membership to NATO in 2009 was the first crucial challenge for Albanian force and NATO. The excellent cooperation between Albanian Air Force and NATO, strongly supported by Izmir Air Component and Shape, brought the success we have today, which is the air policing over Albanian sky. This was just the beginning of a series of other Arguments like the military controller presence in NATO operational room, seated side by side with their civilian colleagues and their training, radar, fleet exchange, agreement on SAR, mission support, as a national common engagement, and so on.